Hi everyone, Dave from Geek and Ides again, and this is my look forward to what I'm going to be getting up to in 2012, and what the year might hold for all of us as well, not just for me. Now, let's look at what I'm expecting to happen in 2012 for everyone, and some of the things that I'm looking forward to, to coming out. Now, the first thing is, very imminently actually, we've got the quad-core uh, tablets coming out. So we've got the likes of the... Uh, Asus Transformer Prime, which I'm going to be getting into the Geekanoid Studio to review. And this is a quad-core tablet, so that is going to absolutely fly when it comes to performance. Also really, really excited for the iPad 3. And I'm hoping that we see that in the first half of 2012. That would be absolutely awesome. Really looking forward to what Apple will do with the next generation iPad. We've also um, got expected, or rumours, that we're going to get a 15 inch MacBook Air. We're definitely going to see updates to the Mac Pro and the iMac line and possibly an Apple TV as well. So a very busy year when it comes to Apple products and I'm going to love it, really looking forward to um, delivering you guys my thoughts on the Apple products and also experiencing them myself. Now in my look back at 2011, the other video that's gone up today, uh, link round about here somewhere, you will have seen me talking about my digital SLR, my Canon 60D. And in 2012, I'm going to be doing a lot more videos on using DSLRs, on lighting, camera angles. I'm going to be pimping this out with some really cool gadgets and sharing what I do with the 60D with you guys and girls. So please do stay tuned for that. It's going to be a really awesome time. Uh, just playing around with this and seeing what sort of quality the 60D can deliver. While we're talking about DSLRs, we're obviously going to see new DSLRs from both Canon and Nikon. Canon 7D Mark II, if that happens, I will get one into review. And from Nikon, who knows what we're going to see. Is it a D400 or D800? I'm not even sure of the model number. Or D7000 Mark II. And I'm sure if I can, I'll get one of those into review as well. What else have I got coming up? Well, uh, imminently, today, or possibly tomorrow, I'll try and do it today, I actually won a competition from Western Digital. So I've got a little swag bag that they delivered to me, which I'll be sharing the contents with you in video format. So you've got that to look forward to. I also got this into review. Let me just unlock and put my password in. This is a budget end tablet. Now we've got the Kindle Fire due soon, but this is the Lenovo IdeaPad A1. And it's a seven inch tablet. Let me just give you a close look at that. So seven inch tablet, uh, just a single core processor, but they're coming in at around about the 169 pound mark. Kindle Fire is gonna be around about the same price as well. So I'll be doing a review of this on my channel soon. Plus when the Kindle Fire comes out, I'll be getting that in and giving you some coverage of that. Uh, what else does 2012 hold? Well, um, I've got a couple of bits going on in my personal life. So you might find, maybe March time, that there might be a couple of days where you don't get a video from me. But after that, I'll be coming back with uh, exhibitions. So hopefully Gadget Show Live, Stuff Live, whatever else is going on in the London area and Birmingham. I'll be trying to attend some of the shows in 2012. Also planning on coming to a meetup once I get my uh, little personal thing out of the way. Trying to come down to a meetup to meet up with some of you guys and girls. I know I keep saying it, but 2012 is the year it's going to happen. Also, I've got a couple of t-shirts. I can't even reach them. They're over there somewhere. But I've been giving away Geekanoids t-shirts. And of the first style, the ones with Geekanoids, the only reason to watch YouTube across the front, I've only got two left. And I will be giving those away on Twitter. So if you don't follow me, follow at Geekanoids on Twitter and keep an eye out for those um, giveaways of those T-shirts. And something else new I've started doing, and leave me some feedback on whether you like this, but when I find technology bargains, 
I've been putting them on my Facebook. Rather than just tweeting them out and them disappearing off your timeline, I'm putting them somewhere permanent so you can go to my Facebook page and hopefully save a few pennies and pounds when you're buying your technology bargains. So keep an eye on that as well. And let me know if you like me doing that. Not everyone seems to be liking it, but let me know. Give me some feedback. So that is me for 2012. I hope you come along for the ride on the Geek and Noise channel. Thank you very much for all your support last year. Keep watching this year and I will see you all in the next video.